double drag it for a man like him back to some new heat for y'all today You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. I don't know. There be days I want to put on lotion, but it be days I don't want to put on lotion. For real? Actually, I have no days where I want to put on lotion. Unless I'm like probably about to hang out with a girl. That's when I put on lotion. It don't make you feel good to not be like ashy? Nah, I'd be good. Okay. Yes, I be feeling like kind of too oily sometimes. I be too feeling too oily. Yeah. I don't like feeling oily. I had a long pass. Mom used to put Vaseline on my face. I'm talking about like you can you can you can take Vaseline off me and put it on your lips. Like it was just like a thick layer on my freaking forehead. Walking out of class, I mean going to class, I couldn't do it, bro. I think she just made me not like Vaseline and lotion and all that stuff. Yeah. I think. uh Recently, I just started like putting more lotion on my body after I'm done with showers and stuff. And it makes me feel kind of good to not be, you know what I'm saying, ashy. Cause if I don't do that, I put on socks. And then when I get done for the day, I take off my socks, feet ashy. You know what I'm saying? But now I put the lotion on, feet don't be like ashy, you know what I'm saying? So the wifey be like, you know, she like that. If I gotta put on lotion for like a girl or a date, I gotta wait at least a, like 10 minutes before I can apply lotion. It's too hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, um, my, 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 uh, my body's steaming. I gotta yeah. chill. Yep. So I sit down, listen to some music, or watch a little, you know, lighthearted show. It's like a whole little routine now. I feel you. What's y'all favorite lotion? Put it down in the comments. And make sure y'all following our channel and don't be no ghost watcher. Big facts. I mean, it's kind of petty. I ain't gonna lie, I'd be ghost watching too. I'm a hypocrite. I used to, but now it's like, if I enjoy the content, I'm gonna start like liking more and subscribing more. Well, I, I probably need to do the same. Yeah. How can I ask of this if I did not do it myself? Yeah. I'm probably still not gonna do it. That's shade. You know what I mean? Yeah, we back with some more One Piece though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, back. Freaking Luffy, freaking waiting on this hockey to come back. Yeah, ended up in the same place as Big Mom. How crazy is that? Yeah, and then yo, Peros is like getting mm. on my nerves, bro. Because if, if if Pedro would have literally took him out, like Big Mom wouldn't be able to chase us and stuff. That's just true. Like he's really the catalyst of moving Big Mom to all these places. You think she could have used Zeus? I she think I, th I think that's why Oda did that because if she would have used Zeus, Nami could have snatched it from under her, mm. and then boom. Yeah, we got him. Yeah, because she used she Zeus to fly before. Yeah. Um. So she should be able to ride on freaking Prometheus too. Ain't this a biatch? If you're able to grab it and throw it, you should be able to ride on that too. Yeah. Shoot, since you're so invincible. And they out of commission right now. Or something I seen them and they like they got left. They got left. Yeah. So they was like, where everybody go? And they still, they still at uh, they still at what's that area called? Whole Cake Island, I think. I don't know. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what the main one called. Yeah, yeah man. man. This remind me of um, uh, Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Because <laughs> of the honey and the nuts. yeah, remind me of Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. Did you, you like, like Winnie the Pooh? Huh? Did you like Winnie the Pooh? I didn't dislike it, but I ain't just like I'm finna go watch Winnie the Pooh. But if I mean, it was, yeah, like, I was just, I was his own. Yeah, it was just like a known, known thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't have a Winnie the Pooh video game. I don't think I had that. You beat it. Hmm. You beat the game. Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. I, I have a thing with beating games. I ain't beat a game since Skyrim, Final Fantasy X. I have, uh, I have attention disorder. Interesting. 
You ain't beat a game in a while? That's crazy. No. I lose interest. I'll be like, okay. I'm going to find something else to do. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. It's, it's, it's kind of sad. I don't know how this developed. That's yeah. Right. Uh, the Winnie the Pooh game, I don't remember. I did beat the Lion King game, though. You've had Lion that King, one? The Lion King one was cracking. Man, I used to hate that first board. I used to get pissed off. But then after that, I started just going through it. Just Mopping. Losing. Yeah, Lion King was Lion King was dope. Y'all had the Lion King on, was it Sega? Sega? Yeah. You're a real one. Heck yeah. <clears throat> I want to see Katakuri and Luffy finish the fight. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it just seemed like, it's, I don't know. I guess it's just, it's, it's just the way the way, I guess it's just the way the arc is, is, is like placed. It seemed like it's a end of the arc fight, but I guess we're getting close to the end. We yeah. only got 18 episodes left. Yeah. And then we need the, the four to five after everything is done to kind of like set up for the world building in the world next building. area. So we really only got about, what, 15, 14? Yeah. I'll take some more world building. It's like the world building gets better and better. Yeah. It just get better and better. Because the more you know. Man, I'm, I'm ready to figure out all of, all of, I need more information on Big Mom, Kaido's backstory. The whole Momonosuke. I Wano look like. And Goldie Roger thing. Yeah. Sabo, I want to see Sabo. We ain't seen Gart. It's a whole lot of stuff. Hey, I ain't say nothing. Then you hoop. Then you hoop. It's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. It's crazy. That's wild. Well, yeah. I ain't trying to be blue balled by this fight, so I need to look at Who do you think will win? Um, Fire Fist Sabo or Fire Fist Ace? Ace. He's the, he's the original. Because you're the original, that means you're strongest. You talk about Sabo with the with the dragon shit, isn't it? That's Sabo. Who you think is like a it's like an external thing or something? Like it's an add-on feature. See, that's hard. We don't know what Ace would have had in the amount of time Sabo had to learn and train. We gotta we gotta take it at Ace's peak. We gotta take it at Sabo where he at right now. I mean, is that not right? That's like saying somebody is 20 years old, they ain't getting enough time to train, but then you want to be like, oh, let's compare him to a 33-year-old who had more time to train. What? It, it ain't been nothing but two years? Two years alone? Let's see what happened with Luffy in two years. Ace could have probably been. <sighs> All right. Sabo okay. or win? All right. What about, what, about, what about them meeting at the same time during Marine Ford? Who you think winning? At the same time, the Marine Ford? Yeah. Yeah, Ace got that for sure. For sure. Because like, Sabo ain't got the flame yet. Because Ace does got he it. need it, though? Ace is still Lokia. What does that mean? That means Lokias can normally beat other Devil Fruits. He don't got a Devil Fruit. Or, that makes it even worse. It doesn't. I don't think it does. My man, like, pretty much, like, has hockey down on lock at that time. Even earlier than that. He had oh, hockey good, down Marine on lock. is pre-time skip. We That's ain't seen Sabo until post-time skip. So we no, don't know. No, no, no. We didn't see it, but it happened before. Huh? Sabo, Sabo had his hockey, I think, what, age 15 or something like that? That's before Marine Ford, bro. I'm saying, but he ain't have it, like, he ain't have the skill he had. That we saw at the time, the Dress Rosa oh, okay. back then. You know what I'm saying? Remember when he infiltrated that that fort by itself, single handedly. Remember that post time skip. Do Do you remember it? Post time skip. Yeah, it was shown post time skip, but it was before that, way before that. Oh, uh, what fort you talking about? When he when he went in by himself, when they first showed that when they first showed that he had hockey. So you trying to say he's as strong as he was in Dress Rosa as he was in Marine? Uh, I don't know about that. But that's all I'm saying. I don't know about that. I think it's a power gap too. That we gotta we gotta account for. I'm but just it, saying, like I can understand if he had hockey, but this man he was literally doing great with hockey, bro. And it was said it was it was inferred. The ace had hockey too. Okay, but in order to in order to even have a an inch with with with, uh, with Logius, 
You gotta have hockey. And he had it. He had it. He's doing pretty well with it. Under Dragon. I'm just saying, I don't know who will win. I'm saying, if it's post time, if it's in Dress Rosa Sabo versus Ace with the with the flame flame, flare flare. Dress Rosa Sabo with, 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 with the fruit or without the fruit? With the fruit. If it's with the fruit, Sabo, hockey at that time versus Ace, Marine four time, Sabo got it. What about without the fruit, Dress Rosa? That's a better debate. That's a better debate. We we really Sabo is okay. So is Sabo without the fruit mopping Jinbe like that? Yes, I don't know about mop, but I but I will take Sabo in the fight against Jinbe. I will take Sabo in the fight against a lot of people. But you thinking about okay? So post time like like dress Rosa Sabo. Yes, even without the fruit. Without the fruit. Like I feel like the fruit made him just op godly. You're like yes. crazy. That's why I said that person, that that version will win against Ace. That version will win. I think, I think without the Devil Fruit, he he can uh, he can get him. At that time, second I can, command. Whew. At that time, but uh, was to put did, some did you on not Ace. see him going up against Isho, bro? Like it was just like they was going tip for tat. I don't, I don't think neither one of them got serious, but he nah, they didn't get serious. Isho definitely didn't get serious. They was just back and forth. Isho did definitely didn't get serious. I don't think both of them did. But e even Isho was like, this dude trouble. He trouble. Yeah. I was just but that's with the fruit though. That was with the fruit. Bro, my man was cold without the fruit, bro. It was a lot of things Sabo would have got mocked with a little bit if he didn't have the Logia part. What? What is he gonna mop him if he didn't have the Logia part? He the whole fight it. against Isho, he was using flame the whole time. It's it's, 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 a, it's a new power. I'm saying what I, I said without the thing, that wouldn't have been. That's what I said. Without the flames, I don't know. He so probably would have just. That's crazy. Be one of these. That's crazy. <laughs> Sit there nigga pack it, bro. But to answer your question, Sabo will win. If, the, if we talk about the post skip, Sabo versus Marine for it, the Ace, and they both got the fruit. Dang. Hey, I just hope he. I hope he just stop using that damn pole. I'm tired of that pole. It's, oh, I know it's sentimental, yeah. but damn, go get something else. Go get smoker weapon for all we care. That freaking weird pole he got. That's it. Yeah, I hope smoker gets stronger too. I ain't gonna lie. Was that last man? That was embarrassing. Yeah, he was bro. taking back to back L's. That was embarrassing, bro. He better come back with everything. He's taking back to back L's. But yeah, I guess we're going to continue with the story and see what happens. All right. You ready to run it up? Let's get it. Dang! Look like each one got different power scaling. Dang, he got the Namira? He probably back by Katakuri. Mm -hmm. Nobody bother me. That's what you should have did when you showed up in Nuts Town. He ain't waste no time, bro. I like I like villains like that though. They don't be they don't be playing. He still tweaked though when he went to go eat. So this dude about to go all over the freaking all over the place then. Is it ship? No, actually, sink? uh. Yo, Big G, W father, bro. That's still hitting it, boy. You ain't worried about them. This man has some shorts and a freaking jacket. He try to fight. Girl, you know ain't nobody about to turn around. Ain't. Hey. What you doing? I can't turn around. Neither. Especially she'd be at a performance like that. Oh hell no, we coming for you. It's kinda it's kinda like a we seeing like a whole different like straw hats family, you know what I'm saying? Yeah.
Come on, Sanji, man. That's true love. Hey, if I'm surrendering, damn, why y'all gotta shoot me? It's crazy. They all siblings, bro. What type of aim? Freak off his motherfucking wife, bro. Beam, my dude. Look over there fighting. He about to get some got to that. <laughs> Gart need to take a freaking lesson, bruh. This bitch. It's family first. Freak. We ain't turning around. It's the way Papa lives. <laughs> That's dope. And we didn't get to end the mission yet. I'm surprised they ain't start shooting yet. Yeah. Get to give me give him beige his moment. Ooh, he mad. Ooh, he mad. <laughs> this carrot. Probably still down about Pedro. Burning him. I think he might try to sacrifice a little bit. I don't see him dying, though. No. He's able to go, go on ground. Because he could turn back into that castle thing, but he you know he take the hits and stuff. You know, everybody had no sea butt on or nothing. I thought Ben knew that. <laughs> Let me do the drive out, G. <laughs> I don't even know what happened. It's You're <laughs> walking the goddamn cart, bro. Oh, shit, man. <laughs> that man, Uppet was like, Cats out the back. So how'd you get a nose bleed like that from a girl? What is this, fast food island? Chip, Chip Town? Chip Town. <laughs> I don't know, see, like, I get captured every freaking time. <laughs> you stupid. Respect. That's exactly what happened to me right now. He freaking saying, bro. <laughs> this is bringing full circle like the Marine Ford. I mean, when Mihawk yeah. showed him slice his hands, but it didn't really happen. That's what I'm talking about, Luffy. So I want to surpass him. Got the determination to get him now. I'm happy. Billy. I'm happy, man. I'm happy. Now I know for sure we ain't finna get blue ball. I ain't finna get blue ball. You think after this, Luffy gonna be a Billy too? After the whole cake arc? Uh, what are you at? 500k? Is, is he at 500k? I thought he was at like 400 or something. I thought he only went up like 100 because of the dress, dress roll. So I don't remember. I can see it. I know Usopp got a higher bounty now, don't he? Nah, Usopp, is, is Usopp just still high? Or they, or they changes it according to their stuff? It's because, yeah, it's not the same as yeah, the world. Dopey said. Different from the Dopey, yeah. But, Damn. 
I can see it. Messing with a Yanko and beating her generals, Cracker, and fighting Katakuri. And hope, it looked like we about to get the dub from that. Excuse me. And surviving Big Mom, like, I can see him being up there. I feel like you get like a billion, a billion, that should be like Yanko status, even though I know he not a Yanko. Uh, Katakuri. Katakuri, but that seemed like that's a good area to, to like have it. And I know Cracker kind of, Cracker was at a, was like, Almost he was at seven hundred something, I think. Almost yeah, at a million. Like seven hundred million. Yeah. Hey, that's a that's a lot of money, man. I'm turning them in. Two for yeah. one special. See, and the wisdom from Rayleigh he said, "Well, you fighting for a long period of time, the hockey gets stronger, especially against stronger opponents." Mm-hmm. My man, Luffy, better be. It's preparing him for the future, bro. Full strength. You see, we gonna see. Do you think, uh, Gar? Can beat Katakuri. Yes. Easily. Easy. Easily. Before, like maybe 10 episodes, what would you think? Easily. Like the whole time you met Katakuri? Easily. What about you? Easy for sure. I was just asking. I feel like Garp is up there with Yonkos. Yeah. You looked as if you didn't think so. Um, I was just thinking in my head, I don't he can't beat no Yonkos, I don't think. But he's like when you say up there, it mean like equal. And I was like, him versus Shanks, he getting mopped. Him versus Kaido, he getting mopped. Him versus Big Mom. It's crazy. Oh, Gart. I ain't talking about Prime Guard who was chasing Goldie Roger. Uh, everybody like to say, will you just be backed him up into a corner? Oh, Guard. You can't do that no more. Guard hater. It's messed up. You put it, you said Shanks would be Guard. Uh, did I say that? I said it was close, if so. That don't, that, you said he would win. Probably because probably he's younger, but. You be talking like he just, he just, he just like a damn Sengoku or something. Like, like he a chump. You think Sengoku a chump? Sengoku is not being like, Sengoku is nowhere near Gart. Nowhere near. You think he a chump though? Yes. I mean, I don't think he like a chump, but it's like he a chump compared to them. Compared to the Yonkos and Gart, he a chump. How close you think they are in uh, power? Saint Goku and Gart. Yep. Mm, I think Gart would win, but I don't think that they're that far away from each other. Okay. And I don't. I know Gart probably wasn't using his full strength, but Saint Goku did hold him down with one arm. The man was emotional. That's why I said I know he probably wasn't using his full strength. But can't. But like in a, in a in emotional state for me, if I'm fighting for something really important, I'm not really like using half my power. If that makes sense, like Goku, like Krillin died, the nigga went Super Saiyan, bro. Like, you don't think he was just emotional and he could have got up if he wanted to? He just yeah. his emotion just didn't get up. Yeah, but I'm just saying we don't have much to go off of. We shouldn't go off of that at all. That's nothing. I just said he wasn't using his full strength, but I'm just saying like, say Goku ain't no chump, bro. I think Garp will win, though. But he ain't, Sengoku ain't no chump, bro. How close on the scale are you? It's like this. Be? Bro, this nigga's literally the commander, bro. So? What's that to do with anything? I'm saying, like... He's strong. He's stronger than, like... Everybody up to, like, Dana Yonko's. What gives you that, that, did you not see Luffy take a hit from him? Yeah, because he's rubber, rubber fruit. Anybody else, he would have okay. mocked him. He turned into a balloon. They always talk about how devil fruits play parts in fights. So he's saying based off his devil fruit, that's why Luffy didn't get affected that bad? That's why he survived like he survived. But Gark smack him upside the head and be knocking him out. Big Mom punch him in gear four and be knocking him out. 
Come on, man. You crazy. You think they go through that that damn close to guard. You wildin'. You wildin'. You wildin'. So you think they they right here. Bro, I literally did not do that. What you do? I did this. Boy, that's bigger than what you did last time. No, you can you go was back. like this. You bro. did you were doing this. I'm saying I said this, bro. I'm like, bro. Garp is here. Sengoku is like, Sengoku beating. Is he beating Magellan? I think he could. I don't even know. He should. He should be able to. That's like, yes it's hard to. It's hard to. Equate. I know he ain't strong, but it's hard to see how weak he is, though. I know he ain't up there with them. Right. So if you go Sengoku, Garp, and then Yonkos. Didn't you say, like, he was. He was stronger than everybody under under Yonkos. Yeah, I'm saying under Yonkos. He's not strong. I don't think he's stronger than 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 any other. Under the admirals, yeah, not the admirals. That's that's under. I think we ain't talking about them. We ain't talking about them. But I don't think I don't think Sengoku can beat the admirals. You think Gar can beat the admiral? Ah. Uh... I don't know if he can. I don't know if old Garp can do that. Bro, Ayokuji with the ice, bro. I don't know, bro. That's a to, tough fight. Suppose he lost to Akainu. Akainu was an admiral. Why would you, why would you, I, like, I know you stopped Garp because he has to maintain his composure, but it should be something else that's like, dang, he stopped him because Garp could have killed him. If he wanted to, he could have killed him. You think Gart beating every admiral? Yep. This this guard, we seen. This guard, I give it to him because old because old people like look how strong Whitebeard was. He's seventy. Look how look how much of a threat he was. That's Whitebeard. Gart is no is not near Whitebeard. He was probably stronger than Whitebeard. What are you talking about? You have. You have a person that was rivaling Goldie Roger, bro. In the back in the day. Whitebeard fighting Gart one on one at what we seen, Whitebeard would literally destroy Gart. I don't think that either. And that's Whitebeard. His devil fruit character. alone was freaking sick. Goldie Roger probably had a crazy devil fruit too. If if Whitebeard could be like that at 70, injured, what do you think Garp can be? You think Garp just depleted? I don't think Garp is nowhere. Is this is Whitebeard? That's different. I think I think when like you you have to see like 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 you need more probably you need probably more in order to like in order to see it. But like I feel like the fact that he's so right good. So Whitebeard is is, is 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 enough. So Whitebeard beating is Garp beating Whitebeard. That's that's a good fight. Yes or no? It's possible. They could go either way. You talking about you gonna mop him? No, no. So Gart at Marine Four, if White Beard and Gart fought, you saying that's a that that fight is going to might have be... been a real problem, especially White Beard injured. He 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 not even healthy. It probably would have it probably would have been a problem. Yeah. You don't think so? I think White Beard wins that fight. That's I'm not crazy. saying White Beard. I ain't gonna say mop like I normally do, but White Bear wins against Garp, bro. I think the fact that Garp just sat there is just is just mind boggling. You like you just don't. I'm not see saying nothing that's crazy. It's White Bear beating Garp. That's not crazy. I think that's crazy. You 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 Garp, said it yourself it's possible. White Bear is my favorite character, and and I have enough sense to think like, man, that could go either way, bro. It was literally though. It was literally those three at the top, at the top. So you mean White tell Beard. me Whitebeard didn't fall off, but but uh, but Garp did? That don't make sense. We seen it's because we seen just like you said. Okay, I have to see more. But well, show me more then, because Garp. But you don't need you don't you don't need more with Shanks though. But we seen it. Seen what? That what did you see from Shanks that 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 proved that he's stronger than Garp? You didn't see nothing. I didn't see nothing. What you see? The way he saved Luffy in the beginning, easy. The way he stopped freaking. The Marine for a kind of shit, isn't it? Easy, just a sword like that. The way he freaking hockey, Conqueror's hockey clash with Whitebeard, split the freaking sky, easy. All we seen from Gart, we seen his flashbacks of his old self being good. What we seen from him now is him 
throwing freaking cannonballs at Luffy. Like, what's what's more that we've seen for him now? But Whitebeard, we literally seen this man fight at Marine Force, actually fight and put on fight against admirals and freaking everybody. We the guard didn't do no type of stuff like that at this age. He was he he can't. He's not supposed to. But what I'm saying is. He's not doing what Whitebeard. If, if Gart was leading. So if somebody's telling you that this man was chasing Goldie Roger down, he rivaled Goldie Roger, tip for tat. They don't tell you nothing. Bro, I literally said the person I'm not that, talking the person about that, old the Gart. person that that taught that taught Shanks every day. I literally said I'm not talking about old Gart. I said that. You can't bring up. You don't have to do anything if Whitebeard is 70 years old and he's that powerful. And then. What about Rayleigh? Rayleigh even said he was stronger back then. And he he freaking fighting Kazaru, matching up with him. That even proved my point. Kazaru. You just proved my point. The fact that you're older, you still got it. You still got some of that. Right, but he ain't going against freaking... If he was said, he said if he was younger, he, he probably just mocked Kazaru. That's what I'm saying. Okay. The power, like, you can't give guard... The credit for what he did passed up. Not, but you keep bringing I'm that up. I'm not giving that. I'm saying he, if Whitebeard is this, is this strong at 70, Garp should be just probably more, if not the same, at whatever age he is now too. And I agree. But I'm no, saying you don't. Whitebeard has the devil fruit though. What does that have to do? We don't know what Garp has. Do you know what Garp has? Do you exactly. know what Shanks have? You don't know what Shanks have either. Exactly. So how you going? What how is you going? You keep saying devil fruit every time in these arguments. Just because you got devil fruit don't mean nothing no more. I know that, but when you have a devil fruit like white bears that's considered the strongest in the world, that counts for something. But not that you's rivaling both white bear and Goldie Roger. Doesn't matter because I'm pretty sure they had the same devil fruit back then. They didn't just get it just now. I know. That's why I kept saying not prime guard. I literally keep prefacing this. <sighs> Garp did get stronger, but he don't got the devil fruit that everybody was fearing. How you know? You don't know what he has. You don't this know like, anything. It's like when I watch Battle Rap, it'd be a 10-year veteran who showed us that he could do it, and then a new person come up on the scene. You don't know what he got, but the the, the safe bet is to go with the person who's been showing you and proving you what's been going on. White Bears was showed us and proved us how he uses devil fruit, how he shook up everything, bruh. Garp, ain't, we don't know what he has. So how are you going to be like, man, it would be a good battle. If you, can talk, if you talk about future things because you don't know what he got, that's fine. But off what we've seen, that's what I'm judging off. The facts. You know, you're not putting all the facts into it. You're putting what you, like, if they threw a punch or something like that. But nothing nothing that was said, none of that. You don't care about none of that stuff. But it's okay. Yeah, because it's in, it in the past. But it's like, I, I'm not saying you wrong. I'm just saying. What 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 was you debating the whole time for then? If you don't think I'm wrong, I'm saying you're not wrong in your thought process of wanting to believe that Gart is you know what I'm saying whatever. I'm saying I believe something different. You know what I'm saying? White beard versus Gart. Who y'all got in the comments? Let me know. If I'm crazy, I'm crazy. I apologize. What are you apologizing for? That's what you believe. That's what you believe. No, but I'm saying if the majority is like, man, now nah, you just, tripping. Just because the majority thinks I'm is is what you believe. It's like it's like it's like you talk to a woman and then you tell her don't do this, but she don't listen. But then her friend tell her to don't do this, then she listen. It, 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 that's how you feel. No. The fact that you got fifty people telling you that is this, that's gonna make you change your mind. You acting like the opinions of others don't carry no weight. I'm not saying it doesn't, but it's like, like how you know them fifty people not stupid too. You see what I'm saying? Not stupid, but it's like. They don't know what they talk about either. I get it, but that's probably like some cases. But if a lot of people are saying the same thing, like the NBA Finals, if everybody's saying the Lakers is going to beat the Bulls 90% of the time, it's like, dang, that's a big chance. You know what I'm saying? Like, but if people is like, bro, you crazy, whatever, I, I take that into consideration. I ain't just that naive to be like, whatever I think is right. Like, I'm not, I'm not like that. Okay. So, White Bear versus Gart, let me know if I'm crazy. We done? Yeah.
I like the fact that he not he not he not running away from it though. Yeah. Damn, I knew he was about to do this. That's crazy. Mm. He lost his ball. What ship was they going to use anyway if he didn't ever show up? I was thinking about that, too. I thought they were about to get on oven ship. Facts. Petty this. Man, the seal was trying to kick it. I'm glad they together, man. You turn. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, bro. <laughs> what is that? Flattened, bro. You gotta be kidding me. That did not just happen. <laughs> oh, shit. Damn, pick him up. You get to meet his grandson. Right. Aw, man. That's crazy. Hey, my babies be knowing shit, isn't it? That's all parents be wanting, man. Man, that's true. They need the cake for themselves. I feel like Frankie should modify Sonny to be able to ride on land. Yeah, I can't let him have his thing. <laughs> we can fly or, or glide in there. Oh, damn. Freaking oven. He is a hater, bro. Damn. Tell him the cake don't get ruined. Shoot. It stop. Wow. Uh-oh. Grandpa about to do something? That baby got observation hockey. And I hope you don't like sacrifice yourself, man. Just start running. Hey, just took a seat. Don't bet my kind of thing. That's how America is now. They can just take the kids. Kick the father to the curb. Hey, he had bit mom when she was kind of, you know what I'm saying? In her prime. The way she looked was interesting, though. Got a new theory. Damn, he about to die, bro. He ain't going through all this stuff. He just be chilling. Not the pacifier like came out the baby mouth. Oh, dog. Wow. Oven is a punk, man, for that. If he killed him. This dude's like freaking snaking him like it ain't nothing. He over here thinking about his family. Right. Big Mom is behind Sonny? Damn. Damn. That's why they be missing. They don't know who the fuck is. 
Not me, not me. Like misconception power, or just misleading power is just ridiculous. That's crazy. He got hands. Who was it? That's not Veggie in them. Damn. Don't get too wild. Trying to prove something. Trying to prove something, man. Facts. Yeah. Uh, Oven is an L, man. If he killed her father, I don't like that dude, man. Hopefully, he just sliced him in the back and he's in prison or something. I just hope he's not dead, man. Cause that that suck. Cause cause. He just came to him like, you just tried to kill your stepson. So why would you try to kill your stepfather? Yeah. My stuff. That's crazy, man. Yeah. I like the, how the baby react to his granddad, though. Mm -hmm. That's pretty, like, wholesome. Wholesome moments. Man. And it kind of beefed up his... It kind of beefed up his character. I could put him in the shrine. Because, cause like, I be wondering, like, sometimes I be knowing backstory gonna come. But I actually like that backstory, man. Yeah. The backstory was dope. And then yeah. it's crazy from like when we first seen him like in the woods, just mm -hmm. stuck in the ground. Annoying. Annoying, but then like Odo just, man, he just do it again, bro. He's buried, man, he's buried. I wonder if he just stayed there because of the kids or he just got trapped there or something. Oh, but my theory, I see. So we kind of know Big Mom as a youngin, right? Mm -hmm. Young Lean Lean, right? She was a pure person. She she cared about people. She was kind hearted. You know what I'm saying? I think because of Mother Carmel's soul soul fruit, she somehow got infused with Big Mom. Whether it's whether it's Big Mom eating her when she was in her confused state, or we just it's something just happened and those two people only saw it. Because she she got I know women wear makeup, she got makeup on, like, and she she kind of treating her um she treating her kids like they assets like the way she said that one line was like y'all um like she, she she can't stand somebody that, that one of her kids that don't give her no value yeah and that's what mother karma was doing she was she was kind of using kids for like for like monetary reasons you know what i'm saying yeah. i think like she kind of like is like that evil like an Aluka in a sense, that. like yeah. she's like the evil part of like Big Mom and stuff, and that's where it came from. I can see that. I think that's what like she was like poisoning her like the whole time. Like maybe it was such a strong soul. Like maybe it might be connected to like how she said that the fact that Prometheus and Zeus had some of her soul. It's a very strong soul that yeah. you just can't get rid of. Yeah. Maybe that's the same with Mother Carmel. And that's really like Mother Carmel was like, it's like poisoning her. Yeah. Like making her be that mean. Like she didn't start off that mean. Like she didn't, she didn't, she didn't, she didn't start I that mean. I talking about when she was a baby? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Like baby, a little kid either. She was like a, like, like a pure kind hearted person. She was. She just didn't know what she was doing was too yeah. much or whatever. Now, now battle can, battle can turn you into that type of person, but yeah. how she be saying things, the makeup, I think that's a like, it, that's a dope like it's possible to be connected. I think bro. that's a dope dope for sure. A dope theory. For Mother sure. Carmel is, is 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 like probably like poison her inside, bro. Damn. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I think that's a um... big mom. She, she got she got a little she, she lost a little weight, but she was still uh, butterface shape. And she probably was thick though. She probably got the gawk. She did. Yeah, she did. Even if that's not the case. That theory is a W. Oh, I hope it's real. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Cause then it kind of like let Big Mom off a little bit. She is a crazy monster, but she was still innocent little little little, little child at the end of the day. You she know what was. I'm she was. You know, she what was saying? Innocent. Like innocent. She wasn't even mean. Unless yeah. she didn't get her to get her way, and then she had those. Tan she always had those tangents. But yeah. as far as the personality trait, I can see where you're going where that mm -hmm. could come from like Mother Carmel. And she lost weight. Mother Carmel was, was like was like she had a nice physique. Now granted, you know, 
Big Mom could lose the weight on her own. I'm not saying she can't lose the weight on her own, but you know, Mother Carmel, you know, she she was heavy on the makeup, on the on the eyeliner, all that, bro. Only thing that's not connect, only thing that's missing, I would say, is the fact that she not smoking. Hmm. Big Mom don't smoke like that. Well, I haven't seen her smoking yeah. at all. So, I think, but then then I think that might, if if the, if the theory is true, that might be a dead giveaway if she was smoking too. That's while true. saying all of that other stuff. That yeah. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, yep, yep, mother caramel, yep. Hey, mm -hmm. that's dope. Still don't know what happened with them. But the thing, the thing that made me like really like solidify and try to think that, that that's what it is, is the fact that she she had that phrase of, of of like having them like these kids are like monetary to her, like they they're there for a reason, and that's the same thing with uh with um uh, uh mother caramel was doing. Definitely took after her. Mm -hmm. so, a lot. Yeah. A lot. And like, how do you take after her if she's if she hasn't been around since she was young? You didn't even know her. You didn't even know Mother Carmel in that spectrum. So you wouldn't you weren't able to pick that up unless her soul is probably still with her. Yeah. It's crazy. That's big brain. We'll see though. That's big brain. But uh, yeah, this episode is pretty cool. Pretty dope. Freaking oven man. I don't man. Like, I don't know. Like, knowing One Piece, I don't, probably don't think he did. He got slashed in the back and he just in prison now. Yeah, knowing One Piece is hard to like see characters. Like, hey, you see this this knife with blood on it? Yeah. You killed them. Because Oda set everything up to be what it's supposed to be and then it'd be something different. So it's hard. You know what I'm saying, but I know it's big and show the beheading of like other people, but you know, the pacifier fell out the baby's mouth. Uh, him doing the slash scream and all that, all the flashbacks and all this, the setup. Right, he just seen you make she died, but if he dies, messed up. He just makes, he just makes oven just a punk, punk. You know what, bro? I hate him. Yeah, but story -wise, I don't like him until proven, proven different. Yeah, story wise, if it happened, it's like I feel like it's good writing. Yeah, I'm put. I'm 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 putting him in the shrine regardless. I think he should be in the shrine. Yeah, it's I like he so. had such a small moment, but it's like his determination of wanting to see his kids at the beginning, yeah. wanting to see, like still try, still fighting to see his kids no matter what. Punching somebody yeah. like hitting somebody, you know, is is not gonna like like you're not gonna win against them for your daughter. Like you do so much for your kids, man. Yeah, I follow like his grandchild. Him was a definite like no debate like going to shrine. Yeah. Also. Bay Beiji came up in my book, bro. That's a fact. Because he had the same, he kind of had the same thing as, as uh, Chief Hoon's father. But when we first seen him, it was kind of like, ah, he's weird. You know, uh -huh. he just wanted to, you know, uh, what they call them? The young generation, the rookie generations. Yeah, the worst, yeah. Worst generations mm -hmm. and all that. But like, after this whole cake, this, this dude is is up there for me, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm rock with Beiji, like for real. Yeah, I was right. Well, oh, but then I don't be saying it though. Just, 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 just let it happen. Like, oh, <laughs> I know you was gonna like him later. That's better. Yeah. Not I, even somebody. You, you don't even know. Right. Damn, we had somebody. This before the time <laughs> skip. Damn. <laughs> Beijy went crazy, bro. So I, Beijy's a W. He's Fact. a W. But yeah, man, this dope episode. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure I take these videos out on our Patreon before you put them on YouTube. Facts. Double dragging out. Peace. Deuces. Oh,